Welcome to this Brightspot automation tutorial on Impel, the image manager for photo and electroluminescence. We're going to show you how to take images with the Brightspot EL camera and enhance them with the Impel software. To start with, we'll load a recipe. We'll do a quick recipe that's just five seconds long for the exposure. And uh, we'll go to the power. Well, here we can see it's centered five seconds. It's a 500 ISO or gain and the aperture or f-stop a little bit closed down 2.2 to increase the depth of field. The power supply is set uh, in current limited mode at nine and a half amps. The voltage is left to float. So now we're going to take a picture and now the camera parameters are being passed to the camera and the shutter opens, performs the exposure and then closes. First displays the original image and then does some enhancements to it. So let's go through what those enhancements are. So we'll go to the process tab. You can see there are four different um, uh, processing steps that were done in, in that order. The first one is vignette where it brightens the corners and there's parameters to control that in the X and Y direction. Next, under multi-process, you can see it did a fisheye correction. So fisheye, there's a matrix of parameters to take that curvature away from using a wide angle lens. And then if we go look at the next one that was performed is a histogram stretch. So we have several different methods that were used. Uh, we used one called adaptive equalization. And here's the resulting histogram. White pixels are all the way on the right and black pixels are on, are on the left. And finally, it did a crop and there's again a few different methods. We used one called Otsu's method to then uh, get rid of the dark area around the module. I also want to point out that if you prefer a colorized scheme of displaying the image, you can you can switch to to colorized. So let's leave it though at the grayscale. And also, if you want, you can analyze the image in a quantitative manner. Here we set up defined a rectangle here, and you can press process, and it'll display the average of the pixel intensity as well as the standard deviation. So now let's try a, a little bit different technique. Let's say you um, have some noise in your image from, say, the sun um, or uh, the overhead uh, lights. So here I, I'll turn on an incandescent bulb, which has some IR that it will add some noise. And we'll do something called dark frame subtraction. We'll also um, change the camera settings a little bit so we don't oversaturate the image. Uh, go down our gain a little bit, and we'll take um, a picture here. So here, it'll first take an image with the power supply on. So you'll be getting a combination of the signal and the noise. And it will display that image. You can see all the area around the panel now. Now it's going to take an image with the power supply off, so it's just noise. And it's going to subtract the two and then do the usual um, enhancement. There's the subtracted image, nice and dark around. And then again, um, it does, does the enhancement. And uh, if you want, again, you can. Um, colorize that image. If you want to see where the images are saved, you can go into camera and uh, the original images are all saved in this folder. And then uh, the enhanced images are, are saved over here. So if you click on one of those, you can, you can view that image and you can zoom in and look in, in finer detail. All right. Thank you very much.